And um, I want to expand a little on what Scott said and Cheryl. NEON was formed a little over two years ago, and we were looking for something that everybody in the county shared, and it was broadband issues. So that came right to the top. Happened to be perfect timing for the BBC application. And I can honestly say without the broadband communities, we wouldn't have had the energy to expend at the time. Now, eventually it'd catch up with us, I'm sure of that. But that gave us that piece of energy and it got a team together and a small group committee formed out of that and really went to work on it. And luckily we got selected, thank you. Um, the, the other piece that I wanted to share is how education has been engaged. We were able to work with Sam and two school districts, two of the smallest school districts. Ellsworth has got to be one of the smallest in the state. I mean, they graduate 10 to 15 kids per year. Um, so we were able to engage them with PCs for People where there was a definite need. Um, 518 is Worthington is probably one of the most diverse school districts in Minnesota. 65% of the kids, I think, are minorities. So I don't know how you can call them minorities when they're 65%. <laughs> um, and we've also engaged um, Minnesota West, the community college. So they've been um, between 518 community education and the Minnesota West, they're actually developing classes to help anyone learn more uh, about how to best use broadband and the internet. So I think we've had some good success stories.